What's going on guys? So unfortunately the class change system that everyone's very excited about uh, might not be coming. We're not really entirely sure. NCSoft put out a statement saying that 83.53%, quite a weird number, uh, were actually not a fan of the class change system. And so NCSoft said the new system will not be implemented on June 30th with the Korean update uh, because we know Unreal Engine 4 came out on the 16th and we're going to get a bunch of new class change systems like this one. We're going to get new content. And this was one of the things that was going to be coming on the 30th. And uh, now they're saying, well, you know, people don't really want it. So we're going to take your time and maybe implement it later. So a lot of people were curious. They're like, well, where did they get this like pull from? Like where, where, where is this random 83.53% objections to this system coming from? Like, where is this from? And basically no one could find this poll from anywhere over in Korea. Now, funny enough, Korea actually made a user made poll with 386 different players. Now, 329 of them said that they agree for a class change voucher system, which is 85%, which is the complete total opposite of what NTSOV is claiming that the Korean player base doesn't want. They're saying 83% of them don't want this system. Now, of course, this is a small margin. It's only 386 players, but uh, it's very concerning, like, where this poll that NCSoft is claiming the Korean player base doesn't want the system is coming from. Like, it's really the polar opposite when they made a user-made poll just from like 300, almost 400 players. So it's very interesting, like, where is this coming from? Because it seems like most people are a fan of this. I mean, anyone from like my comments when I announced this system on my YouTube channel and I covered it, everyone was saying they would love to see this. They can't wait to see this. Sounds like fun. And like now, like, there's there's claiming that people don't want this. I just, I don't really believe that's true. It just seems very weird. Uh, some people are saying maybe they got this poll from like China because clearly they didn't get it from Korea. But why would they be polling players in China for a system that's going to be implemented in Korea that's supposed to come on the 30th? That just doesn't really make sense to me at all. So honestly, like NCSoft is probably just being dishonest here in my opinion. I don't know. I, it just seems very fishy. Everything about this seems very fishy. I mean, maybe, maybe they're being honest and people don't want it, but... <laughs> I mean, people are making just user-made polls and like Korean players are saying they want it. Like, I just, I don't understand where this poll is coming from. I love to see the data. I love to see where NCSoft, like how many people did they actually have in the poll? Did they have like 10 people and 80 of them said, no, they didn't want the class change system. And then they're like, okay, let's not do it. Or did they have thousands of players? And if they did, where was this poll? Because people would have at least like leaked it and said that NCSoft is polling people. Like, I just don't understand where this came from. And I love to see more information, but knowing NCSoft, I don't think we're going to get any. I think they're just going to say, well, you guys didn't want it. And, uh, you know, maybe we'll try to implement it later. But very unfortunate because I think this would have been a fun system. Uh, really, my theory, and yeah, I could be wrong. I'm just guessing. But I feel like this is a business standpoint. They decide to delay it because they make way more money just milking the player base who re-rolls to each new class that comes out. Uh, just think about it. They have a class change voucher, which costs, what, maybe 30 to 50 bucks at the most. That is insanely more cheaper to swap over compared to someone who has to re-roll from scratch and which happens every year. Like these whales, when like the Astromancer came out for us or when the Archer came out, these whales are spending thousands of dollars to re-roll to a new character. It is not cheap gearing up a whole new character, getting all their accessories. I mean, sir, some things you can seal over like the soul, but these weapons and these accessories, certain items, you have to upgrade all over again. It's costing thousands of dollars to do this if you want to upgrade really fast. And you see them upgrades like Matt's gear like instantly, like obviously they're swiping, like it just makes total sense. So NCSoft is probably looking at it like, well, do we want them to spend like 50 something dollars or spend thousands of dollars? Hmm, business standpoint. Hmm, okay, let's just uh, say that uh, they didn't want the system and we'll just like take it out. That's what made sense to me. I mean, I could be wrong. I could be trying to throw like a conspiracy here, but I just don't understand like where they got this pull from and they're being secretive about it. And I mean, the data shows that Korean players actually do want it. So like, what what's going on here? It's very fishy, but um, let me know in the comments below what you guys think. Do you think they just like made this crap up and just said, oh, they, they people don't want it so they can make more money off people re-rolling? Because in my opinion, I think they would lose money with this voucher. Um, obviously, the player base would be more happy, but they don't really care about that. They just want the most money they can make, obviously. So let me know what you guys think about this. Where did they get this pull from? Please, someone tell me. <laughs> Because uh, clearly the Korean players don't agree with this poll. They, they clearly want the system. The majority of them do. So uh, I don't know what's going on here. But it's very unfortunate because it looks like we're not going to get the system anytime soon. Even maybe not even get it at all, honestly. Uh, but it remains to be postponed. 
maybe we'll get it in the future but uh it's just sad to see because i know a lot of people would love to have this voucher system but um let me know in the comments below what you guys think about this and uh make sure you leave a like sub to the channel as always i'll keep you guys updated but uh the class chain system is looking to be delayed uh indefinitely for now